you know, for us, it's just going to be a couple of days of some snow and uh, yes, yeah, some rain, some gusty winds and some cool temperatures. We already started feeling it today, but even more so as we head into uh, the beginning and the middle of the week. Look at numbers outside. Plenty of 50s and even some 40s already in places like Malibu at 46. We have mid 50s in Long Beach, uh, Cypress at 56 degrees, low 50s in Anaheim. So uh, plenty of 50s across most of our region, including the Inland Empire. We're starting to see some 40s out there. Also, Yukaipa 46 as well as Beaumont 30s up in the mountains for Big Bear and Lake Arrowhead. Here's our satellite radar. Plenty of cloud cover. And as we head into tomorrow, we're going to continue to see those numbers drop. More cloud cover moving in with that deepening marine layer. Gusty onshore winds and yes, even some rain, snow, low elevation snow dropping down as low as about two to three thousand feet. So here's a look at future cast taking you into uh, tomorrow morning. We'll start seeing a little bit of drizzle, some light showers just ahead of that main front pushing through on Tuesday. That's when we're expecting to see the bulk of the rain, especially by the afternoon, evening hours into early Wednesday and snow levels dropping by Tuesday night into early Wednesday. That means a lot of the passes will be impacted. Also, even some foothill communities. So uh, if you are even traveling out to Banning, the I-10 could see a dusting of snow. Winter storm watch across some of our mountain areas and into the, some of those deserts. Winds right now, not too bad, but we are expecting to see those winds intensify as we head into tomorrow morning. By the early part of your Monday, we're already going to see some gusty onshore winds gusting to 30, 40, even nearly 50 miles per hour through at least the middle of the week and uh, we have advisories in place uh, wind advisory and high wind watch especially for the mountains and deserts that's where we're expecting some of those strongest winds as this area of low pressure starts to drop south and continues into Wednesday again with those lowering snow levels uh, very low we're talking uh, down to some of those uh, passes the grapevine the 15 through the Cajon Pass before things clear out on Thursday and we start seeing a warming trend as we head into next weekend with 70s back in the forecast. Here's a look at the extended outlook mid 70s for some of those valleys LA Inland Orange County next weekend looking really nice. Uh, just got to get through a few cool days uh, with some rain and some gusty winds and of course that low elevation snow as well. Back to you guys.